The Demonic Trial of Tengu Shredder by uh, CJ right, Tengu Shredder. Shredder. It is time for another installment of the Shredder Trials. Oh my God, Ghost with the five. Appreciate you. For the prestigious honor of having a seat at the round table. And that next challenger is none other than the Tengu. Demonic. Avengers level threat, the Tengu Shredder. So we ain't gonna waste no time. Without further ado, it is time to continue the Shredder, Shredder Trials. <laughs> Exhibit A. Y'all ready, ladies and gentlemen? Yeah, I know it's funny. I'll present to you. I know it's funny. CJ talks like this. CJ talks like this, bro. The uh, the Shredder Trials Exhibit A. This is not for the video. This is actual factual, bro. From hell. Now, the Tengu Shredder is from the depths of hell. Why does that keep coming on? Huh? Now, I know some of y'all coming out to be shook. Because first we talked about an alien, and now we're talking about a demon. I know some of y'all probably thought Shredder was just a human. Well, I mean, the next trial we will be talking about the human version, but... This one, however, though, yeah, get ready to strap in. So to understand all of this, we have to go back all the way to 300 AD. Now, as we can see, this village is burning and people are running mm -hmm. for their mm -hmm. lives because they are under attack by a Tengu that was called the Shredder. Shredder. Yep. See, yeah. see, see. This big ass Godzilla looking motherfucker was the original Shredder that came from the depths of hell to wreak havoc on Earth. <clears throat> and look at it. He is killing the He is going crazy. Extra crispy. And this demon just wreaked havoc and destroyed everything in his path. So to stop the Shredder, Jeez the Emperor Louise. of Japan gathered the five greatest warriors in the world. And of those warriors, one of them was none other than the, the original Yo! Roku Saki. <laughs> Trom Shredder stole this whole niggas flow to gain respect and have a higher place in society. Yo. So these uh -huh. great warriors were given secret <coughs> armor and they yep. set out to defeat the Shredder. Now, before that battle even starts, we got to pump the brick. We already know how this goes. Let's be honest. How oh, the story goes. I ain't gonna lie. How the story goes. I ain't gonna lie to you. I'm gonna lay it out for you. Flip it like a pancake. Put a sausage in the middle. Scramble right, some right. eggs. Put it on top of that. Put it on the beef pan. Ma! It sounds delicious! Cut. Don't forget your bath. Mm -hmm. Never, never. Mm -hmm. Right? This TMNT is gone. Damn, what a button's it? Which one are you trying to... This is gonna ruffle some feathers. Right, right, right. Oh, you jumped on the setup yesterday. That's what oh, yeah, you yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, gonna, it's gonna ruffle some feathers. Uh huh. This TMNT. Top two and it's not two. Mmm! Mmm! Thank you. I appreciate that. Because look at this shit. That is a whole village over there Dead. that has been burnt down and destroyed. And by my calculations, those villagers are 99.9% .9 dead. Yeah, I they mean, go. let's be real. It's they a go. game. They probably snatched all their damn souls. But anyways, the warriors pull up on Shredder and oh. immediately start to get washed. They say oh. no chance. Oh. Look at this dude and his poor horse. Shredder winded up his fist mm. all the way to the heavens and slumped that nigga all the way to the Mississippi River. <laughs> right here. Blood tried to hit him with a mace and chain him up around this tree but the demon said he like what is this <laughs> what is this what, what do you think you're doing Wash that nigga so the only Come person on, bro. was able to give this demon a fight was none other than a roku saki now saki was actually able to damage huh. he was huh. so strong he was able to cut off the demon's arm and actually bring it to its knees so it looked like it was all over the world was about to be saved okay. saki told him go back to the hell from which you came from demon but right before he was about to the killing blow the demon invaded his mind and he started oh, to whoa. seduce this man so the shredder made him a offer he told him oh great warrior i can give you everything that you desire money power oh chico bitches you say the craziest <laughs> part this is the craziest part this nigga invaded the mind of an alien this nigga invaded the mind of an alien and seduced it. Mm. Like this, he's a demon. He's a demon, man. Just from across the world. Oh, you. You say. Countless bitches from across the world. 
across the world. <laughs> Why you keep going back? <laughs> across the world. Hmm. Hmm. Great offer. Great offer. Oh my god. <laughs> All you have to do is sell me your soul. W lag is crazy. Offer. <laughs> Saki took the deal. He sold his soul. So he destroyed the body of the demon to make it look like he defeated him. But in all actuality, it's in him. Yep. Merged with him. And Oroku Saki became the host of the Shredder. So they returned to Yamato. And they Jesus were Christ. welcomed back with a party by the Emperor and all of the people. So the Emperor is up here praising them, giving them the glory, the honor, and all the glaze. But little did he and everybody else know that the worst was yet to come. Because later on, right after the ceremony, Saki, or no, let me rephrase that. The Shredder came back to Yamato, surrounded by demons, and destroyed the whole place. Massacre. Oh, this fool. OP. OP. So, um, the Emperor? Yeah, that nigga's dead. He gone. And over time, he just plunged the entire world into darkness. Nobody could stop this nigga. Not even armies. They all failed. He became the world's most feared warlord. And on top of that, he was a Avengers level threat. It was mm -hmm. hopeless. This was the Demon King that all the Isekai protagonists are summoned to come defeat. Facts. So there was only one way to stop this Demon King Shredder. The what four is that? other ninjas that used to be his Mikey, why didn't you help? Had to oh my learn God. mystic. Why, why didn't you help, bro? I wasn't there, bro. It's a cartoon. Oh, yeah, but you would have been around during that time, though, no. right? Okay. Yeah. All right. It makes sense, though. Bro. All right arts so they could ascend to godhood because that was the only way they were gonna be able I'm not gonna lie remember these four niggas okay all right they were ass at first I need to press this <laughs> Just remember well, yeah, these they four just niggas. learned mystic shit. Oh, it's in the gods. So yeah, yeah, yeah. Years later, after they finished training and became gods, they went to confront their old friend. Okay. Now, as we can see, run it back. Or should I call him Oroku Hefner? Is having a good old time <laughs> with his bitches. The royal penis is clean, your highness. Until the four dragon warriors bust up in his crib. So obviously, this man Shredder was pissed. He told him, "Oh, you cock blocking motherfuckers. We were just about Bro, see to this way, y'all." Messed up, bro. You don't you don't pop up on a fool and talk to him. You pop up and get to swing it. Yeah, bro. You Why jump through the window. Yeah. You jump through the window on his throne and get to bro. Uh, bro. Uh, he gotta uh, he gotta be like this getting head. And just yeah. start whipping his ass. Tight that nigga. Oh, 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 he gotta be, oh, he gotta be gotta coming and pushing. Keep sucking his dick. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Ah, ah, ah. If he can come back from that, he deserves it. He deserves it. it. No cap. Betrayed us, your best friends, all for what, Saki? For a taste of pussy? Oh, don't act like I was in the wrong. Hanging out with you, pussyless. Them niggas lame, bro. Why are we about? talking? Jump him, please, bro. Bro, bro they could have stabbed him in the back, bro. They literally could have caught him so off guard. Bro, fuck honor. <laughs> yeah, oh, fuck honor. honor. Kill him. So Shredder attacks him, but the four dragons were ready because with their mystic arts, they look at him, bro. So they imagine if he didn't see it coming. Down. Hell, they couldn't even believe it. So the Shredder decided it was time to release his full power. So this man, the dragon, forms into a dragon. Wow, wow, the health because bar is insane, to CJ. <laughs> But then you gotta remember, oh wait, these niggas are also gods too. So wait. they transformed into dragon yeah. as well. Okay. So it was time for the final boss battle with the world at stake. A big ass dragon battle. So the motherfucking Green Ranger mm. is from the mm. smashes him in the ground. But this man, man jump this fool! Explosive wave, sending everybody. Y'all waiting on, bro? Ranger got flung all the way into a mountain. And oh my god, look what he did to the Green Ranger. Nigga grabbed her neck and planted uh -oh. her in the ground. Then he threw her so hard it destroyed the whole castle. But the four dragons were persistent. Even though they was getting they ass whooped and getting bitch slapped, they kept on jumping them. So then the Yellow Ranger ends up turning into Kung Lao. Nigga threw his hat and it turned into a shuriken, cutting off both of his hands. Oh, then oh, they start using oh. Key there we go. There we go. So he ended up running out of key for his transformation and ended up falling all the way down to the ground. The Shredder's reign of terror was finally over. There we go. 
So the four dragons came up with a plan because they knew they couldn't kill him because this man was a entity. Death would not hold this man back. So they decided to seal him so he would never resurrect. So these okay. four ninjas ended up becoming the legendary ninja what tribunal. Up, cool? And their whole purpose was to watch over this man's casket and to train warriors if this man ever resurrected. And they did this for 1700 years. So everything seemed Damn. Like fine and dandy until his acolytes broke in, stole his casket, and resurrected him. The Shredder. Oh my yep. God! Exhibit A wrap up. Multiple <laughs> mass murders. Mm -hmm. Property damage. Multiple attempted murders. Treason. Mischief. I mean, at some point, once you become a demon, you might as well just bro. do it all. Like, imagine being so good, nobody can defeat you. You just... Bro, I, be, I be thinking about it sometimes, Chad. Right? Like, not being a demon. Right? But, imagine you so powerful, you can do anything you want. Life gotta be born at that point. That's why he got everything at his fingertips, bro. Like, like you gotta come up with stuff to do. Like, you gotta come up with evil to do just to stop yourself from being bored, bro. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> Children's <laughs> hospital. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> of the highest order, war crimes. Crime, yep. Exhibit B. Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, I now present to you Exhibit B: Dark Resurrection. So, as I stated at the end of Exhibit A, the Shredder's mystic acolytes broke into the tribunal's temple and stole the Shredder's casket. So they now, what the hell are the turtles so supposed to do? Back to prison day <laughs> New York, and his acolytes are performing the ritual in the Chrysler building. I know this man Spider-Man Mad doing this satanic shit on his turf. So to resurrect the Shredder, <laughs> Who the hell was that? Recite Spider-Man Mad doing this satanic Who is this? I don't know. He hit that old. He hit that joint. To resurrect the Shredder, they had to recite these words and say it in unison. Oh, Undertaker. <laughs> Mickey Mouse. Who's <laughs> got <Scott>, Mickey Mouse? <laughs> so, using the ancient speech to summon the Mickey Mouse Clubhouse, the Shredder arose from the dead and his body was completely rebuilt into the form of a demon. And his oh, that's right. This is before Oroki changed. This is the original that Oroku saw. I forgot. I forgot. Right. So the alien stole that nigga whole flow. Yeah, that's what. You yeah, said yeah, yeah, yeah. So that he, nigga really died. He was human when he got taken over by the demon. Yeah. And then they, when he yeah. came, he was like, "Yeah, yeah I'm, I'm stealing that nigga." Yeah. yeah. Way before the alien. Yeah. Or was so strong he blew the place up. So once the acolytes knew this man was back, they instantly started glazing. This nigga Shredder was on some Roman Reigns shit. The first thing he said out the. Oh, CJ loves Ra Roman Reigns. Yeah. My tribal chief. Fuck Roman, bro. Fuck Roman, nigga. Ask it was. Hit that bitch ass nigga with crossroads. Challenge <laughs> me. Oh, yes, me lord. So Shredder was itching to do some bad things because uh, itching, the man's been itching. sealed for 1,700 years. But Famous? also, the acolytes told him about the Utram Shredder and how he impersonated him for years. And even though Utram Shredder isn't here anymore, Karai became the new Shredder. So this man was lit and immediately attacked his acolytes. And bro was yelling at him and telling him, Oh, okay, so this is... Let those bum-ass niggas tarnish my name. Oh, man. This is a real Shredder. Okay, so Shredder did his thing, mm -hmm. died. Ultron came, impersonated him, died, and then now the real is back. Yeah. And this is a later version of TMNT. Yeah. Okay. Uh -huh. So the first thing on this man's agenda was to head to the foot headquarters. And while he was on the way, he decided to cause mayhem. Nick oh, yeah. Now, yeah, they can't do nothing with this. And just destroying everything, causing multiple car crashes, blowing up newspaper stands, vandalizing Imagine. the statue outside of the Rockefeller Center. And my God, this was the worst one. He let this motherfucker oh. right here burn alive. Oh. 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 This show was shown on four kids, by the way. So it Shredder did. arrives at Foot Clan HQ and doesn't even decide to use the door that's clearly right there. Nah, he just blows a massive hole open. 
So a massive amount of foot ninjas come up and try to ambush him. But Shredder was about to catch a hundred bodies in just five seconds. Because yeah. he immediately blows up the entire area, killing damn near every foot ninja in the blast radius. And it went so quick, he was disappointed. Shredder looked at their corpses and said, You call yourselves ninja? Pathetic. Put the fries in the bag. So this is <laughs> they deploys every single mech that they have to try to stop. Not enough. They failed miserably, getting eviscerated. It's not enough. Spot. And just look at this carnage, bro. They stood no chance. Nigga right here got folded like an omelet. So Shredder proceeded to get all the way to the top floor. And he is right. immediately met by the elite the guard. guard. The yep. same elite guard that put Leonardo in a coma for a week. And you but they, they nowhere near weapons. enough. He what are we talking about? To grab their weapons. What are we talking about? What are we talking about? The Foot Clan elites got one shot by this man. Unbelievable. So the last people to try to stop him were these recon ninja trying to seal him, but this did not work at all because this man just breaks out of what they tried to seal him in and brutally snatches their souls. He left their bodies a empty husk. So oh Shredder my was losing Jesus. Pages. He yelled, Karai! All right, also, I have to say this. Um, Karai was fine. Karai was fine. I mean, it's probably not many people gonna argue with that. Karai was fine. Now imagine being the turtles, right? But you defeat a shredder, or you think you about to defeat him. Turns out he's an alien. No, 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 no. You go through all of that. No, no, no. You thinking about it wrong, huh? Think you thinking about it all wrong? Because you, 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 you said imagine I'm a turtle, right? Right. You got to give a little bit more than that. Imagine you a teenage mutant ninja turtle, six foot tall, muscular. 12 inches in thick. <laughs> you got everything in the world, cuz. You and your brothers out here kill, kill an alien. Fight an alien. You fight an alien. Yeah. You take them down. Somebody else becomes shreddy. you like, oh, slight work. Whatever. Cool. A demon shredder. Come. How? We barely beat the alien! Bro, you wanna know the craziest part? You wanna know the craziest part? They end up going to the future too, and they fight a future shredder. Oh my god! Bring your bitch ass out here! So Karai comes out in her shredder armor, and she is not having this. She told this man, Okay, first of all, boo boo, I'm gonna need you to lower that tone. Rolling up on my turf on some bush. Uh, on some bow. What the fuck you think you is? The shredder? I'm a psychologist, nigga. You don't think I can read right through your phony ass? Newsflash, old nigga. Is that Omar? Yeah. Now. So Karai what? tries to attack him, but bro immediately grabs her. And yeah, you don't stand a chance. And Shredder was feeling himself. <laughs> you, know saying? Oh, you don't yeah. stand a chance. All right, kitty. Get a good, get a good nap or sleep. Her across the room again. This nigga did not come to play games. So Karai had to pull out her trump card. Oh, the green eyes. Holy water and threw it on the nigga. And she oh, actually oh, started pushing oh, him. She oh, had this man scrambling. Oh. So then she kicks him on the wall and stabs him right in the ground. Oh. And bro falls to his knees. And it looks like Karai is won. Then they finish the supply holy water, bro. Oh, you need shit, it. This man did. His helmet falls off and he just looks at Daughter. her. And her emotions start to get the best of her. Because she sees his face and she's like, oh. Daddy? Oh, oh. sweet child. Oh, so she comes he's down evil. To try to help him because she thinks this he's is her evil. dad. But he turns his face back into a demon oh. and just starts laughing at her. She is legit traumatized. And bro oh. just gets up and rips the sword out of his stomach. Nigga said, Foolish little girl. Oh. <laughs> so he turns the sword into a snake and just has it chase her around while he's just watching and laughing. The yeah, just give, just give him a throw, bro. This is a sick nigga. Just give him a throw, bro. Drop kicks her, and she ends up running into a pole, and the snake wraps her up. Oh, so before hell. he's about to deliver the final oh, strike, hell. he's giving her a choice of, do you want to die by my claws or my serpent's fangs? Choose wisely now. So when he's going in for the kill, she makes a hard read and ducks this man, and he ends up cutting off the serpent. Okay. Head. So Shredder lost all his patience. He grabbed her and just threw her on the wall. And bro floated up to her and told her, You dare call yourself Shredder? You fucking fraud. Take this shit off. 
Oh, so he oh. rips off her armor and then he he's just toying with his food. This entire show. In his exact words, I quote: "After looking at you, perhaps I should let you live. After all, you would make a fine slave." Ah, freaky ass turtle. My boy say, "That nigga say I'm a concubine. I'm be a little slut." I mean, but is he wrong though? He's a demon. I'm like, after looking at you, I'm saying like after like with his what his eyes are seeing is he, you know, type shit. What? I usually skip this part, bro. I'm just saying like, I'm not saying you should enslave people. I'm saying like he ripped the arm off. He like damn the body, yada 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 yada, you know. Are we wrong here? All right, my fault. I want a reminder that this was on four kids, by the way. So the turtles finally <laughs> up with some new I mystical fall. abilities that they got from training with the tribunal. And this show oh. has never met these turtles yet. So this he is was confused. How. He was like, talking turtles. The fuck are you supposed to be, nigga turtles? <laughs> Get out! So Shredder <laughs> said, to hell with it. It's time to pull out my ultimate technique. So this man floats up and says, Domain expansion. <laughs> Yes, this shredder has Whoa. a domain expansion. Whoa. And it is broken Whoa. because his domain Whoa. expansion allows him to raise every enemy he's killed. Whoa! Whoa! Whoa. All those people he killed during his conquest back in 300. Every last yeah, one of them. Bring them right back up along with other creatures from the nether realm. Whoa. So he has them attack everybody and they can't do nothing because every time they take one out, they just They just get back, back up. up. They, they not real. Army. But here comes Karai again, but she got a new toy. She got a holy water sword. So she starts clashing swords <laughs> with Shredder and she actually ends up landing a hit. But this just pissed him off because he walked her down and cut her sword in half. Jesus Christ. Oh, fuck. So he walked her down and had his undead grab her. I don't know why you try to solo so anyway. He's about to kill her, but Karai his boyfriend, Dr. Chaplin, shoots this nigga with a holy water gun, blowing a hole oh in his god! But this did nothing. This man was Ill. truly immortal. He started laughing and just regenerated. Ill. So yep. he looked at her boyfriend and said, Oh, your turn. I get it. Is this your girl, nigga? Well, if it is, congratulations. Because you have a front row seat of me blowing your bitch back out. Oh. oh. Be honest with you, I don't oh. know how the hell Karai survived this. I don't. She should be well, dead, he hit dead as hell. So Shredder blows everybody off the roof, and the turtles and everybody got to retreat. This battle was hopeless. They got their ass beat. Karai got put in a coma and lost all the drip. She has no sauce. But you know where she can get that drip back at? <laughs> she can get that sauce back on CJ the Champ. Doc. What? <laughs> Link in the description. Look at that T two mil merch. Oh, W plug. Exhibit B wrap up. Attempted <coughs> murder, murder, arson, criminal mischief, mass murder, mass murder, yeah. assault, vehicular manslaughter. manslaughter. Exhibit C. Oh my God! Alrighty, yeah, ladies and gents, it is now time for our final exhibit. Oh exhibit yeah, let's do it. Hell on earth. So, yeah, so after Shredder brutalized and destroyed the Foot Clan in a night, he decided it's time to take over New York. So he makes his way over to the mayor's house. Oh wow! Like oh he door like a civilized citizen. No, never, never. Through the roof so he could fly in never. and assert his dominance. So the mayor was terrified while Shredder was up here floating and saying, "This is what you deserve for those foolish tax cuts, you fat fool." So he picks Help! this man up and Help! throws him to the side of the wall. That man's back has got to be broken. He threw him so hard, he made a dent in the wall. Ooh. And that man is not the fuck out. Ooh. He just assaulted a government official, broke his back, and the way his head landed, he, he might be dead. He might, yeah, he might. Levels of CTE. Oh. So it was time for Shredder to enact his plan. He started using his domain expansion to transform the entire city into hell on earth. Yo. You didn't even have to kill the mayor. People even got hit. You didn't even have to kill the mayor. You forget he evil, bro. I know what. Like, why would the, he? The mayor step was 
Complete. You could have just did that from the tower. You gotta think about it, bro. Like you said, he bored. Hey, he gotta be. He Cause bored, like, bro. oh, I'm thinking he about to take the mayor and maybe ho hoist him up. This is your mayor. He, this is my city now. Type shit. No, he just, no, no. he just threw the mayor against the wall. Nah. Your mayor. What? Yeah, think about it, bro. That nigga not. That nigga not. <laughs> No, The man would have died anyway. Make sure it covered everything. <laughs> this man transformed back into his oh my dragon god dragon form and spread it out his domain all the way throughout the entire city. And when he was done, he turned the entire city into hell. There is a fucking volcano in Times Square. <laughs> Look at the Statue of Liberty. What the hell is that? And Shredder wasn't even gonna stop here. He was going to spread his domain across the entire planet, but he needed time to rest before he could do it. So the Ninja Turtles and everybody had to come up okay. with a plan. And that was Brain Blast. the Avengers. They had to get other right. acolytes from the tribunal, uh -huh. Agent Bishop and Dr. Stockman from their shadow organization, okay. every superhero in the city, right. and collide with whatever was left right. with the foot. So they all go to Shredder's stronghold Yo. to assault the base. Yo, let's get it. Fight through floors of monsters and kill the Shredder's mystic acolytes. They finally reached his throne room and he welcomed them in because he wanted to kill them personally because all of them were trained by the tribunal, the people that sealed him to begin mm -hmm. with. Okay. Before he was about to attack, Karai pulled out some mystic ninjutsu to start draining this man's power. So this actually ends up knocking him down because they finally found a weakness against this man. So this big bastard hun walks up to bro's body and kicks him and he's like, <laughs> nigga, you ain't shit compared to Master Shroud. Ah, uh, too confident. Nigga, you trash. Too confident. Hey, hey, y'all think Hun could be Toru? Y'all think Hun could be Toru, chat? From Jackie Chan Adventures? No. No, I don't think so either. Mm. They both some big ass niggas. But I don't think he beat Toru. Mm. I just thought about it because them niggas look the same size. Okay. Maybe if they met in the beginning, but no. Nah. Mm. But Hun celebrated too soon. Way too Shredder soon, bro. What are you, what are you doing? He's a demon. Dare you put your lowly monkey feet on my drip, nigga. You should focus on facing that back to back. Kitchen General, appreciate the sub. So the final oh, battle oh, finally started. Oh. Bootleg Superman Silver Century what tried the? to punch him, but got blocked immediately. And bro started breaking his arm and telling him, "My God, bro, we gotta work as a team, bro. What are we doing?" Coming in fashion and throws him to God knows where. Bro, hit him with the Team Rocket special. Blasting <laughs> off again. So this man charges up a massive key blast and blasts everybody outside of the stronghold. And Jesus starts Christ. And at full Jesus. speed on a demon horse with a trident. So this man tries to impale Raphael, but he ended up dodging it. And he ends up getting surrounded by all eight of the acolytes trained by the tribunal. But he didn't care that he was about to get jumped. Matter of fact, he was filled with joy. He wanted he to know what's coming. So Raphael he know what's coming. to attack, yeah. along with the bride from Kill Bill. But he throws Raphael in the shorty. Then here comes Hanzo. He gets washed and thrown to the side. Jesus just Christ. like Overwatch. Garbage. So here comes Mikey from the other side. But he gets first choked, slammed on the ground. Then he got drugged, hit Donatello, and they both got slammed on a tree with thorns. This man just hit a collateral. So then Leonardo and the last two dudes try to attack him. But they get hit by that Wukong that, immobilized. Oh, and you just see him get blown up in the distance. So this man just caught like eight assault charges. And you know what? I saw this comment on my last video. You forgot to mention that these are teenage mutant ninja turtles. And you True. Know what? You're damn right. So guess mm. what? We hitting that nigga with child abuse. Child abuse, yup. So Master Splinter runs over here and he's grieving over his sons getting their ass beat. And while the ancient one is behind him trying to comfort him, his fat ass gets Whoa. shots. Whoa. Uh, hey. So the Shredder is looking at Master Splinter, and all hope seems lost. Bro, leave me alone, bro. Amulets end up using the power of ass pool. Power of plot armor, bro. 
of Hamato Yoshi comes out of the ambulance and he is wounding this man's soul. All of his evil energy is leaking out of him. So to repair himself, he had to take down his domain expansion and absorb mm. all of that energy and turn back into his dragon form. So Master Splinter mm. had to give these boys a pep talk. He told them, oh, my sons. Clutch a kick. Yeah, clutch a kick, bro. Shit and into the dragon so these boys ended up manifesting dragon oh they got their own yeah the tribunal did in 300 ad so the fate of the i ain't gonna lie they dragons are cooler though the turtle dragons way cooler where the hell the tribunal at these niggas still down they <laughs> no they had to train them because they they lost their power oh well, they don't have down to another okay. dance of the dragon so they start pushing them, but they get bitch slapped. But Leonardo lands a Kamehameha and puts his ass in the dirt. But this was not going to stop him. Raphael came in to get a bite just to get bitch slapped hey. across New York and landed on a yacht. Oh, God, people weren't on there. Then Donatello and Michelangelo take a double facial. Oh, you saw him. Um, but here comes Leonardo. Uh -huh. You saw him look at them? Look how he looked at Double facial. Oh, yeah. shit. Yeah. I was, oh, shit. <laughs> oh, oh. But here comes Leonardo hitting him with a kamikaze. I hope to God nobody is in these buildings right now because yeah. if they are, they are dead. So Leonardo ended up taking himself out on that shoulder bash, and Shredder got up and made his way to Karai because she was trying to use that dark magic shit on him again. So he flies down, and the first person he goes for is none other than oh. Baxter. Stop oh, him. Baxter. <laughs> This man oh, Baxter. Baxter. Whatever Shredder it is, it doesn't matter. At the end of the day, they oh. always got two things in common. Hating turtles and abusing hey. Baxter oh, Stockman. No. So he is eating this oh. thing, fucking Dr. Chaplin again. So he is about to chow down on Karai. But Raphael and Donatello grab him by the mm. snout. And Mike Get your bitch ass. Spear, Get your bitch ass. Big ass. And that gave Karai enough time to finish the ritual and zapping all of this man's dark energy. So they start jumping, playing ping pong with his ass. And it got so bad, he ended up losing his helmet and his gauntlet. And that is significant because that makes him a mortal being again. So Donatello comes from the top rope and sits on him. <laughs> then after pinning him down, nah, all right now. he end up manifesting the spirit of Hamato Yoshi again. So this man Shredder was pissed. He was yelling at him like, no, I will not lose to some bullshit. This makes no fucking sense. You are right. It doesn't make a lick of sense. But it doesn't matter because mm. this is on four kids. Hamato <laughs> Yoshi jumps up and throws oh. us this nigga. Oh. Him right down the middle. Get him go! And that's how we do it. Conclusion. Right, everybody. We now turn our attention to the board of charges. And my God, just look at it. Look Man. at it! Absolutely Man. nasty work. Man. Multiple War charges crimes unknown. Multiple counts. I think it's safe to say another shredder, another seat at the table. Jesus Christ. Of course. This spread is ridiculous. And we still got one. Oh my God. To go. I don't know about that TMNT Shredder. Is he that bad, chat? This last one, <laughs> he takes hating oh, to this another one. level. So before I get out of here, I just got the to off for two mil real quick. Congrats on the two, two milli. Insane. It's still so surreal to me, man, because I had no clue I would get this far. I was just doing this shit in college for fun and voila. But hey, man, I wouldn't take it back. So I love every single one of y'all. And until the final trial. The Shredder, Shredder Trials. He gotta be just more like hater energy. Yeah, I, I don't know much. About he gotta this be one. like, why are you doing this? Type? Like Arctic, like why, bro? Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Cause I didn't watch that one. I didn't mm -hmm. like um. Yeah, pettiness. I don't like the 3D animation style of that one. Like ah. it was cool. Like I, like my little brother watched it, but it wasn't one for me.